Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be vlogging because I am going to Iceland with Chris, who's my boyfriend. Um, this is actually our first trip away together as well. Um, and I'm so, so excited. Um, Iceland's the top of my bucket list. Um, I can't actually believe that it's happening. It doesn't feel real. Um, I also slept in today, shocker. Uh, <laughs> I was supposed to get up at 8 and I slept into 5 to 11. But I'm ready now, it's half 12. Fully packed, fully organised, I hope. Um, I'm getting lifted at half one, so I think I'm gonna go get something to eat because I am hungry. So, I'm so excited and I can't wait to bring you all along with me. So we are in Iceland and we just picked up the car. What is it, a Hyundai? A Hyundai i20. It's actually quite a nice wee car. So we've just left the airport. It's so weird seeing everything on the other side of the My back side of the car. Thing. But um, what was different about that airport is whenever you come through it, the duty free, you still get to go through the duty free stuff. So we bought like apple ciders and a berry apple cider. And a seat to the root. <laughs> and we also got a big thing of champagne. So we're right on to read Janus Broad. <laughs> Can I turn that off? You're being rudely interrupted. <laughs> In 1.1 miles at the roundabout, take the first exit onto Reed Janus Broad. <laughs> anyway, it was a really, really nice uh, airport. I was really impressed with the toilet. It had a Dyson sink. The sink dried my hands as well as washed them. It was the weirdest thing I've ever encountered. But yeah, now we're just driving to Reykjavik to find our hotel. Could be a while. Could be a while. Could be. And um, we don't really know what else we're gonna do tonight. We're gonna explore a bit. It's quite late. What time is it? Half seven? Half seven. Half seven. Of course yeah. time. Can't see the time. So. And we're driving on the other side of the road. Driving the other side of the road, Christopher is... I'm not going to leave it. Well, we're good. Together. Okay, I'll, I'll have to go and let him concentrate. Catch, catch us later. Bye bye. Why is there music playing? Why is there music playing? Are we this? in somebody's room? You're going to love this. Why am I going to love this? <gasps> no way. Walking into stuff. <gasps> we have the best view of that building ever. Yeah. Oh my goodness. We don't really get to see much of the harbour, but we get to see that building. The one that changed colours. Oh, it's cute. Do you know what it reminds me of? Yeah. An ATAP in Belfast. Have you ever stayed yeah. in an IBIS? ATAP? No. Oh my god, that's exactly what it reminds me of. It's cute though. Is that a bathroom? Oh. What the hell? I don't understand. Is that the shower? It's like a pop-up shower. Where's the light? Oh my god. It's a wet room. <laughs> so you pull this. So you just pull it out. And yeah. there you go, you've made a shower. Yeah. And the sink. And oh, what's actually quite cute. And there's a makeup mirror, so I don't mind. We actually can't see anything. Like we're right on the harbour, like the coastline, but we can't see anything. Um, although all the buildings here are so strange, like the shape of them. I can't believe the sea barn is right around the right corner from our hotel. Way, yeah. Um, 
we watch, well I watch, Fly in the Nests vlogs and they both were in Iceland about a month ago and they went and had lobster soup at the sea barn and I really want to go and have lobster soup at the sea barn yeah. <laughs> because it just looks so nice. Yeah, we'll go tomorrow. We'll go tomorrow. Tomorrow, some stage when we're here. Yes, because, well, no, we're going to maybe get up early tomorrow and go Should we? road tripping. We are indeed. Down by the southern coast. So we'll get to see the black sand beaches, the waterfalls, and all that stuff. So it's exciting. It's very exciting. Good for now. I'm hungry. All right, I'll catch up with you later. So we've just arrived at a lighthouse. Um, it's meant to be like a popular place where you can see the northern lights and we're going to get out, even though we know we're not going to be able to see the northern lights because it's cloudy AF. So we just had a very unsuccessful northern lights trip so we thought we'd come and try and see the church at night time what's this church called harka flung and flourishing <laughs> We're going to come back whenever it's daylight and you can get a lift up to the top and see over the entire city of Reykjavik. I think this is a monument, I don't know if you're allowed to stand on it. I needed to get a view. <laughs> I couldn't get far enough back. It's crazy. So cool like. It's about 20 to 9 in the morning. It's so weird. The sun doesn't rise here until about half 10, I think. Breakfast ends at 10, so that's why we wanted to get up and have breakfast because today we are going on a road trip around the south coast of Iceland. We're going to see as many sites as we possibly can. Um, we're going to have breakfast and get ourselves all filled up and then we're going to a shop called Bonus. We've seen loads of them everywhere. They're meant to be like um, like Lidl's and Al Aldi's and things like that. Um, so we're just going to get like um, pack lunchy things, you know, snacks to bring with us. <laughs> I'm so tired. Although this morning when Chris's alarm went off, I pinged up and I was like slapping on the makeup and the tan and curling my hair and he's only up there now so he got a wee lie in. Lucky him. So yeah, keep his post it. So we're right here and this is lovely coastline. I don't want it. So that's where our retail is. So I need to get ready, put my clothes on. Catch up with you later. Evening time. Okay. <laughs> so we just went up the stairs, up the lift, okay. and got um, buffet. a buffet breakfast sort of thing. We started off with pancake. No, we started no, off, start with off with eggs, bacon, and eggs, bacon, and sausage. But the sausages tasted like little tiny pepperamis. <laughs> so we literally have just left our hotel. And we're driving because we want to find a wee bonus, which is like a little Aldi. And this is what is right out our window. I don't know if they can see it. It's like mountains. We didn't even know that they were there because we couldn't see anything last night.
So, <laughs> What's it called? Right, we, we don't know how to pronounce this. The big guy standing right the way at the sign. Oh, there's a fella stand. We stopped at the first stop, which is a waterfall. Yeah, got absolutely drenched. It was so wet, I couldn't believe it. You loved it. You had like it was great. water all over your face and I was like hiding from it. I could have bounced in further. I just seen like little water droplets all over my camera and my phone and I had a heart attack. I was like, get me out of here. <laughs> Sel Jalans Foss. Foss is waterfall. This is a waterfall. Let me get it back. There it is. <laughs> so this is our first stop and we have an hour before we get to the Black Sand Lake sandwiches and crisps and for cheaper than Red Bull KFC last night. Pepsi. We got so much stuff like a wee grocery shop and it was cheaper than a KFC that we got last night. It's not bad. It's not bad. So yeah, now we're just going to go to the next destination. Alright? Yes. We'll catch up with you soon. I'm glad I wore boots today. I would have told you I thought this was the one you had to pay for. Yeah, I know. It's all because you get behind and get good clothes. I know. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited! Oh! So on the way here, we thought, oh well, we maybe hike up there. And now we're Absolutely looking at it. No. Uh, we're thinking, definitely no. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. No, it was really nice, it was cool, like I've never seen anything like that. But it was so windy and cold and I just oh. really needed to get back to the car because oh. we're both hungry, aren't we? Hungry and cold. We're just gonna eat and then we'll catch back up with you. Yep. Next speech. Bye. <laughs> my god, <laughs> I have no energy. <laughs> so, you'll probably not even be able to see us properly. Uh, froze. That's worse. That is. So, we just went to see the plane wreckage, but we thought, oh yeah. It's just parked beside the road. We thought it's it'll beside be fine. the road. We'll have a dander. We'll or go we could, see it. We could drive down to it. Easy. Um, but you can't drive down to it, you have to park in a car park and walk. Yeah. And um It's a five mile walk, all right. When you, yeah, we kind of like we oh my god my face is so cold. <laughs> we sort of like had a competition to see who could guess how many miles it was. Yeah. And I guessed three and you guessed two, but three. it's two point four miles one way. So we walked it down and walked it back and But the plane was good. Plane was it cold. was good, yeah, but so long that was a long walk and it was just so straight and I said to Chris like the perception was so like misleading yeah you thought like you were deceiving yeah. you thought you were so much closer but like the walk it, you would walk another 10 minutes and look like you were no closer than you were before 
point. Just had to tell you that it wasn't fucking nice. It was worth it, but it wasn't nice. Yeah. I haven't really caught up with you in a while because last night we went Northern Lights hunting and it was unsuccessful. Unsuccessful. It was freezing though, um, but we seen the stars. It was a really cool nice. to see the stars. The but so now cool. we are here in the daylight and we're going to go to the top. Way up there somewhere. And that there is where we're planning to go for some coffee and ice cream, even though it's freezing. <laughs> So we just went to Loki and we did. I don't think that that was a good experience. Chris hasn't, Chris isn't really, I'm not a big fish guy. he's not into fish at all and we had seen this couple who are flying the nest on YouTube vlog that they went to Loki and tried these like things on rye bread so we decided to try the exact same things that they did and <laughs> I didn't mind mine because mine was like a mashed white fish on rye bread yeah. and it was quite subtle yeah, but Chris egg. got herring and egg on rye bread and I he took the first bite and I swear <coughs> his eyes started watering he was like heaving he was like covering in his mouth <laughs> he thought he was gonna boke at the table so oh, I was gonna boke at the table I just wanted to show you that right up there with that window, that is our room and this is our view. We got such a bloody good room. So, my camera's about to die and I haven't got one charged. I don't know how I used more battery today taking pictures than I did. Um, filming so much yesterday but um we're going out for dinner tonight to the sea bar and i'm going to try and take as much footage as i possibly can but if i don't get to say good night then my camera has most likely died so that's why and yeah i'll catch up with you later also do you like my little people earrings so cute So this is our last full day in Iceland and we slept in again today because we're up late again looking for the northern lights which hasn't been successful so we've only got one shot one yeah. shot left we're trying to find them I'm gonna cry if we don't see them because I really want to see them but um we're heading down to the harbour the harbour yes because there's this little fish and chip van that we've heard good things about and we want to get fish and chips before we head off on another road trip road trip yep high up into the mountains the, the wilderness golden circle golden yeah, circle we're going to see the geysers and the gulfoss waterfalls today and finally see the national park in daylight 
Oh yeah, we've been to it twice and we haven't even seen it. No. So, that's what's happening today. And I'm so excited for fish and chips. <laughs> I've never had so much fish in my life. No. We went to the sea barn last night and... It was awesome. So good. Right, we'll catch up with you later. So, we came the whole way down to the harbour. And it's closed until spring. I'm so upset. I really wanted to have that fish and chips, but there's no fish and chip cart there anymore. This one dimes well. <laughs> We got fish and chips! I'm so excited. I've never really had fish and chips from anywhere else other than home. No. And a big dirty chippy. But I ordered a cocktail sauce because that was like one of the sides and he hasn't had cocktail sauce no. before. And I think he's gonna like it because I love it. Although you're not really into seafood. I've had more seafood yesterday than I have my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> and I enjoy half of it. Two, two thirds of it. <laughs> two thirds of it. <laughs> this is our wee motor, by the way. Look how dirty it is. A little high and die I 20. This is the big reveal. I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, that looks good. The bar looks class. Oh, my goodness. Doesn't it? It's not like a big... We're just at the geysers now. Um, we haven't seen one of them around yet. But you can see just like streams of hot water everywhere. 